Well, it has been over a month since a teen was shot and killed inside her family's apartment in Lawrence. That shooter is still on the run tonight. And our David McAnally talked with the victim's mother tonight, who wants justice for her little girl. Shiloh Britton's smile. That's what her mother remembers. She really was a great person. She was extremely smart. She was extremely talented. And early in the morning, last December 6th, the 16-year-old Lawrence High School student was extremely vulnerable. Shiloh's mom had just taken one child to school and returned to the family's apartment to get Shiloh and her brother off. At 7, I just heard the mom just screaming, yelling, help me, help me, help me, my baby, my baby, my baby. Neighbors ran to help. And I just sent blood. That's all I seen. And I ran back out. And she was like, my baby's in there, my baby's in there. So when I ran back there, I just seen her slunched over. The family thinks a male acquaintance came to the house while they slept. Shiloh may have let him in. She hadn't been here long enough to experience enough life to be able to recognize when something is off about somebody. This man came into my home and murdered her. She was just naive, and it cost her her life. Jealousy may have been the motive, she says. Whatever led to that fatal gunshot... I heard nothing. ...was a silencer used, unclear, but the damage was done. The killer left the home. That's evil. That's evil. There is nothing that you can imagine or, or dream up that she could have done to deserve for you to shoot her in her bedroom, in her home, with her little brothers next door to her. She asked anybody with information to call Lawrence police. I, I will fight for her until the day I leave here. If he did it to my daughter, he has that in him, and he will do it again. Lawrence police say they're staying on top of this case. They continue to make progress, they say, but they do need those tips from the public. David McAnally, Channel 13 Eyewitness News.